everyone, I'm so excited. Yay, I'm so happy. Hi. <laughs> I don't even know where to go. Hi guys. I am coming to you for the very first time from my new apartment. I literally can't believe that this is finally happening. I literally just got here. I got the keys like 10 minutes ago and came over. I'm not actually fully moving in for a couple more days, but I'm starting to bring things over. Um, the first plan for like right now, I want to clean the place because it's not like dirty, like it is brand new, but there obviously people came in to see it and everything there's been showing so i just want to give the place a good clean up real quick before i start like actually bringing all my stuff in so that's the plan but i'm literally so i like can't believe it i'll show you guys it um just you know don't like go google where i live and stuff. oh my gosh i really need to get a new vlog camera it keeps on failing me okay yeah basically this is a little rundown this is like the living room. So I'm gonna get my couch there. Like so, a little coffee table and then a little stand here for the TV. And then that's my room in there, which I'll show you in a second. And that's all the stuff I just brought. And that's the little kitchen space. Obviously it's small, but for me, it's perfect. And that's my office, which I'm so excited about. And I got this nice big closet here to fill up with all my work supplies, which is just super exciting. And then, yeah, obviously, bathroom, the huge in there. And then, this is my bedroom. Look how much light comes in, it's so pretty. And then, I have a freaking walk-in closet. Is this real life? All I've ever wanted in life is to have a walk-in closet, so I'm really happy. Okay, so I am going to whip out the vacuum and start cleaning and I'll attempt to record some, but <laughs> my poor camera just keeps on failing. I can't even see myself now. <laughs> yeah, so I'm gonna clean up the whole place real quick, get it ready, and um, I'm just so excited right now. Okay, you guys wanna see my vacuum? Because I'm in love with it, and I don't think I've ever spoken about it on camera before. This is the Miele Compact C2 Cat and Dog. It was around $800. I got it a little over two years ago, like right before moving to my last place. And it is literally my favorite thing ever. I love cleaning. And with this, like, um, I mean, nothing is dirty enough to, for it to be. Okay, in my old place, like when I move furniture out from the walls, there is gonna be so much dust on the baseboards and the vacuum cleans it up in like a second and it is so unbelievably satisfying. But yeah, I've had Dyson vacuums um, and I think this is so much better and like the same price. So that's just my little two cents. I think this vacuum is literally the greatest thing in the world and I'm obsessed with it. And um, yeah, I just didn't get on well with Dyson vacuums. I'm not like crazy about them, but this one, yes. This is like my baby. I'm so in love with it. Especially because I have a kitty and she likes to set her hair everywhere. Okay, so I'm gonna vacuum now. Okay, I found something that I can do to show you guys how amazing this vacuum is. Oh my God, this video feels sponsored. I swear it isn't. I just actually love it. And um, since I'm cleaning, I figured I'd tell you guys some of my favorite cleaning things. So. For instance, I was just about to vacuum this up. I have no idea what this is. It was on the other windows too. It's just like a bunch of like, almost little pieces of tin foil. I don't know, it must be something that they used to make the windows, but it's really hard to see. Are you seeing that? Okay, yeah. Now watch how quickly and easily it will take up all of this in like 0.25 seconds. It's so satisfying. How happy am I right now, you guys? Oh my gosh. So I finished kind of cleaning as best I can. I forgot to bring sponges. I swear I put them in the bag like I remember. So maybe I put them in a bag, in like the wrong bag or didn't bring the bag or something. I'm really confused. 
but I think I just, you know, did a pretty good job regardless. Um, this is the place so far. Um, those are open because I think I still wanted to clean them. I don't know why I left it, but yeah. So clean all the floors and this is gonna be the start of a little pile I'm gonna make of all of the new kind of decor things that I still need to put in the haul video. Cause I was gonna film, in fact, I did film. Um, oh, I love it, you guys, I'm so happy. I filmed, I filmed the ASMR haul the other day, I tried to, and it was, it just didn't go well. <laughs> So I woke up on Thursday, I think, to try and film that video at like two in the morning, like normal. And I obviously didn't get much sleep at all. And I was really tired and grumpy. And then in addition, River had decided that it was her breakfast time. I mean, there was only two, like I couldn't, I was like, River, it's literally two, like you can't eat. But she obviously was like, you're awake. That means it's breakfast time. So um, I just got really frustrated. And even though I did film a good like 45 minutes worth, but I just, when I went to edit it, it just was like, oh, this could be so much better. And then I didn't even get a chance to actually put it all in. Oh my God, my eyelashes are driving me crazy. I haven't brushed them yet today. So yeah, anyways, um, I'm making that little pile there so that I can film an ASMR haul of all my new things, hopefully tomorrow morning here. Um, even though I'm not moving for a couple of days, I'm gonna keep bringing more things over today and hopefully I'll have enough. Uh, but yeah, and I put the bathroom, I put up like the clear shower curtain, so I'm gonna leave the other one right now. And the little towel-y, uh, yeah, what's that called? Floor blanket? <laughs> oh my God. Um, rug, no, bath mat, there we go. <laughs> oh my God, that was horrible. Um, and I have this uh, handheld shower that I'm gonna try and get like, I don't know, my boyfriend or one of his friends when they come to help me move <laughs> install because I actually don't even know where to start. I mean, I could probably figure it out. Although it is really sad because look how nice this shower head looks. Like it looks so cool and like bougie as fuck. Like look at this. It's so modern. Wow. Is this really my life? But yeah, anyways, I'm taking that out even though it looks really cool and fancy and like I've never had a shower head that cool looking. Um, but because handheld ones are just so necessary for like cleaning all the parts of your body and also cleaning a friggin' shower without a handheld shower head like the most annoying thing on the planet like i don't want to do that i'm gonna head back now and grab some more things and um come back and do it all again basically i'm also gonna go home now and hope that um <laughs> i can hopefully place an order on structube or like my couch and things like that <laughs> i tried yesterday my credit card got declined but i paid my card off so it's just like taking takes some time to realize that it's it can buy stuff again <laughs> yes if you know you know so yeah anyways i'm gonna hopefully also do that when i get back first and maybe have a snack and then um come back and do it all again and i'm just so excited because i love it here so freaking much and then right here like it's the kitchen obviously so right here i'm getting this island built from ikea it ended up being quite expensive but still cheaper than buying like a pre-made island island because i wanted one to store it because i don't have that many cupboards like i need more storage space especially like, like i just know that i do so the island will have quite a bit of storage but then also um a good like place to film cooking videos and stuff you know i feel like it'll be really good the lighting is nice i'm excited i'm gonna go now and i'll update you guys probably when i get back here I'm just back at my place for a little just to have a snack and grab more things Said hi to River. Oh, someone's at the door. Sorry, just got a huge package from Urban Outfitters, but yes, I'm with River. I'm sleeping on my, just my pillow now because I got rid of all like the colorful ones. I love them, like they're still super cute. It's just not what I'm, you know, just want to try a new design idea in the new place, but I don't think she's mad. She looks really comfy. She's also obsessed with the floor pillows that I got from Urban Outfitters, which I'm actually gonna bring right now, so maybe I'll show you when we get there. But um, yeah, oh, this is my apartment <laughs> currently. So <laughs> when I say I'm feeling a little stressed, I think you guys can understand why. <laughs> and also all of this. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm gonna head back over now and try to bring a few more things. 
back again, started unpacking already, and I'm gonna now lay out the carpets that I got from Urban Outfitters. I really hope they look nice, I'm really excited. thing to stop it from sticking is way too small I don't understand <laughs> but yeah how pretty is the rug <laughs> I'm so happy <laughs> that's and then I'm gonna put like a desk there and then on this side it's gonna be like the filming side and we'll have like a cute little chair I mean I don't have money for that yet but I want like a cute little chair and like my clothing rack and it'll be super cute oh my god I'm so excited Okay, I just laid out all the, like, the new bits and bobs that I still need to film for tomorrow. I think I'm gonna sit on this little cushion and film. It's gonna be cute. I'm so excited. Sorry, music. But now I am going to sit here and attempt to build this like bathroom wall shelf that I got from Wayfair. So, <laughs> let's see how I do. I like to think I'm a pretty handy girl. I can figure this shit out, so let's see. Legit thinking, like you get me a coffee. <laughs> we have greetings over Kansas that were very pleasant today. However, we are looking for a new front to begin to drift south and eastward. The central and eastern parts of Kansas will very probably be cloudy in the morning, and then western Kansas will begin to get increasing cloudiness by tomorrow afternoon. Today, however, a very, very pleasant reading 73 up in the Goodland area, 72 at Garden City, 70 reported by Dodge City and Liberal, 72 2 2 over by the good folks of Guam. Hi, it is um, Saturday now. I came back to the place today to attempt to film some ASMR videos, but it is loud as right now. Like literally, I'm just hoping that it's the time of day because it is Saturday, like 9.30 or something. I'm just hoping that it's just like a loud time and that it's, there's gonna be some time pockets and windows that aren't in the middle of the night because if I have to wake up at 3 a.m. still, I will stop making case smart videos to be honest or like have to just I don't know like I can't do it anymore because it means that I don't get anything else done because my whole sleep schedule is just gets messed up I don't I don't like it I don't, I don't want to look like that anymore um, yeah so I came to film videos turns out it's too loud so I'm like true what am I gonna do like crying like having a mental breakdown um, I don't know I'm gonna also upload the the audio footage to my computer. I didn't bring my computer, but once I get home and listen to it, because maybe it's not as bad. It is. <laughs> I feel like it is. But I think it will help once I bring in all my furniture, because right now the place is totally empty. Like, there's just like a rug, you know? So I feel like that will help with blocking sound. And then once I bring my window coverings and stuff like that, I think I'll be able to make it work. And hopefully, again, there's quieter times. <laughs> and I need to get a new goddamn vlog camera. Ah! No, the viewfinder is falling completely off. Um, yeah. <laughs> was that all I have to say? Oh, basically I was in a really crappy mood, but then um, I talked to my boyfriend and he gave me, we had our little morning phone call that we have every day. 
Um, and I'm gonna leave that in mood because he's the best, but I'm just so in love. <laughs> so yeah, now I'm like, true, I have nothing to do really. I mean, I could stay and do more things, but I'd rather just leave <laughs> and just have like a nice day off where I'm not stressing about anything. So I'm gonna go hang out with my boyfriend, which is nice. And um, yeah, I'll come back here tomorrow because they're having a kid delivery. And then, you know, maybe I'll film some videos tomorrow afternoon. We'll see. We'll see. But um, yeah. I'll give you guys a little update, I guess. Kitchen. And obviously, there's nothing in the bedroom, but I started bringing clothes into the. <laughs> Gotta sort this all out. But look at this, guys. I'm so excited to have a walk-in closet. I've always wanted this. So like, I still love the place. I think it's unfathomably cute. And then this was my little setup. But I mean, how cute is everything that I got, by the way? This is all from Urban Outfitters. Um, I'll obviously show you guys when I do like a home tour and everything. Unless you guys want a home or a haul, but I was gonna try and film an ASMR style. <laughs> but maybe I'll just have to do it. We'll see. And then I also have a bunch of new PJs that I got from H&M. I still need to try them all on, but like I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep them all. Um, yeah, so my boyfriend is gonna go pick up a coffee for me because he was already going to McDonald's. And I'm just gonna go sit with him and read and then have a nice little day. I wanna walk, um, I wanna go to Struck 2 because I still want to, even though I placed my order, um, I haven't actually tested like the couch that I ordered. So I would like to just like, confirm that it's comfy <laughs> you know and maybe get some like plant pots and stuff because Destructive has some really cute ones so yeah that's all for now I'm just gonna go and pretend that this morning didn't happen and that today isn't going as horribly um because hopefully I'll just come back another day and it'll be nice and quiet we'll see and I'm in my underwear and there are filters across the street so I'm so high up, but because there's like condos everywhere, there's just people across. And I didn't close the blinds and I took my pants off because I forgot. <laughs> Great. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna drink my green juice too, by the way. This is from, oh, that's the French side. Lover too. French is cute. Um, the good cold pressed and organic cucumber, spinach, romaine, celery, lemon, Himalayan salt from Greenhouse Juice Co. I'm really liking all their stuff they have. It's really good. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hi guys. So it's been a couple of days now. It is Monday. Um, so I've spent the last couple of days moving things in. The place looks so good. I thought I would give you guys a little sort of mini tour and update of the place and also a little mini haul because I got some things from anthropology like their homeware section in the mail today so i figured i'd also show you all that because i brought that to the new place today um but yeah so the builders literally just left like 10 minutes ago they came over to build the kitchen island i'm so happy i think it looks so amazing i will try my best to find the guy's like google review or anything that i can link um, not sponsor or anything, but he did such a good job, him and his, like, I don't know, helper dude. <laughs> and they cleaned up after themselves and everything. But yeah, I just think it looks so good. And it's literally just the Ikea kitchen cabinets, but then they, like, installed it all for me. Um, so I'm really happy. Kitchen's kind of coming together, which is amazing. And then in here, I've got my compost. And then this is recycling, but I just have so many big black garbage bags right now. So I'm not sure. <laughs> Maybe I'll just like take that out and dump it and then if it gets wet, I have it and I can put it in the bin or the rubbish or whatever. But yeah, and then there's also this little secret drawer. So I've got like more bags and poop bags for River and cleaning supplies stuff. Not much yet because it's not all here, obviously. And then here is gonna be hopefully like to store food and everything. I've got these three little mesh things that you can pull out. So I can put like cans or food, I don't know, chips, <laughs> whatever. And then again, I just have these three drawers and a nice big one as well. How cute is this? So I think in the end, all of like the Ikea stuff that I needed to make this was like almost a thousand dollars. So it was obviously not cheap and then obviously I paid someone to build it because I was like, I ain't got a clue how to cut um, countertop. But 
Uh, so I think in the end it was maybe about $1,400, but if you guys have looked on Wayfair, any of those places to have like a nice kitchen island that actually has storage and is cute and usable, like this is just literally so perfect. Um, they're all at least $1,500 and like not half as cute. So I was like, I'd rather go through the struggle and do this and that way I get exactly what I want for like a reasonable in comparison to other ones but obviously ridiculously expensive i hate that but like what <laughs> but yeah i think it looks so cute i'm so happy <laughs> i'm hoping you can see me i can barely see my viewfinder because my camera is just totally broken um but your girl doesn't have an extra 700 dollars <laughs> lying around to get another one but okay i'll give you guys a little haul actually i have these two cups from urban outfitters this one that has little um eyeball kind of so I think that's so cute. So I'm gonna wash that in a second and also this little boob mug Which I think is really cute and then I got these really cute little kind of ice cream bowls But these are like tiny like the kind you'd use for like sauce for dipping or like little nuts and snacks and things like that But how cute so I got two white ones And then also a really cute little lilac and then a sort of like dark teal and then I also got I'm really sad a blue one and the mint one, look how cute they are, but they chipped. So, I mean, I guess I'll keep them. They're probably still use, you know, helpful to have. But how sad. The colors are so cute. And then I got the exact same bowls, but a bigger version. These were called, I think, the cereal bowls. They're really nice size. So I know I'm gonna use these a lot, especially like oatmeal and things like that. And apparently they're dishwasher and microwave safe. And then I just got one really cute plate because anthropology is expensive. I got all of this when they were having a sale on their homeware a couple of weeks ago, which was really lucky. But yeah, I just got one really cute little plate. It's like blue with speckles and then speckles? Oh, but isn't it speckles? I'm not sure. Speckles, right? <laughs> um, and then like a little gold trim. I think it's really pretty, but yeah, I just didn't want to buy. I think that plate on its own was almost $20, which is kind of stupid. So I only really wanted to get one because it's just me. And then I got this. This is by Rifle Paper Co. It's like a little weekly list, like to-do lists and things like that, which I thought would be really handy to have in the office. And I also got this clear acrylic little magazine rack kind of holder, but I'll probably use it for like more notebooks and things like that. Um, but yeah, I just got this as well, which will go on my little bookshelf. And then I got one cute little coaster. This is just like the white agate. I got, I don't know how you say it, but you know what I mean, like the cool like design with a little gold trimming as well. But again, I only got one because they aren't, <laughs> I think that was like $12 and I was like, I only need one. <laughs> and then I got a really cute like rose gold copper, no copper, little pair of scissors that I've used and so far they work and everything and they are really cute. And then I got some golden knobs for the Hemnes like shoe dresser that I have from Ikea, I have to make it still, but I wanted the like cuter knobs. I don't really like the knobs that come on the Hemnes, like the black ones. And so I got this from Anthropology. Now like they're not the greatest quality and I'm kind of upset. There's like some stains and stuff on it. And they only also sent three, even though I ordered four and like need four. So that's annoying as well. So I'm definitely gonna email Anthropology and see if they can help like fix the situation. <laughs> Cause that's so annoying, especially because anthropology is so expensive. Like the least they can do is send something that isn't broken or I probably broke on the way. I don't know, but still, still annoying. <laughs> and then this is from Wayfair, but these are in front of me. So I'll show you. I got two like copper, but with silver insides, um, bowls. Then I totally saw them for cheaper at HomeSense. So check there first. <laughs> HomeSense has everything cute and then you regret paying full price for it. And also these are from Amazon, but I got like a little lipstick holder. And also I'm, I'm so excited about, excited. I'm really happy about this because I always kind of never want to have too many eyeshadow palettes because they're really hard to like store. But this I'm going to put in a drawer and look, you can have however many slots this is of palettes. And I mean, I probably only fill a half, but like, it's still really good to have for stores and stuff, especially now because they do get sent a lot of makeup products and things like that. Like I kind of need to think about storage for extra things because I guess part of my job maybe moving forward more so will be like makeup-y bits and bobs. So to have more makeup and play around with more makeup and make more cool videos for you guys, I just think it makes sense. But that means I do need to have more storage for it. So 
that's what all of that is for. Okay, that's my little anthropology haul. I guess I'm gonna go wash these all now and um, pretty much head out after that, but I'll probably update you guys. Um, yeah, yay, I'm so happy. So I'm just editing this video now and um, turns out the audio on the rest of the footage is like muffled and weird thanks to my amazing vlog camera. So yeah, I just figured I would end the video here for you instead so you can actually hear me. Thank you very, very much for watching. I hope you guys liked it. Not the greatest of vlogging as you all know, but I tried. So hopefully you found it a little bit enjoyable. I'm like obsessed with home decor stuff right now. So let me know any like thoughts or tips or anything um, in that realm or just anything in general. I hope you're doing really, really well. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Um, and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you again very, very soon. And look, I'm just sitting in my office. A little update, you can't really see much from this angle. My desk here, and I put my little floor pillow. And then River's sitting there. <laughs> so she's just hanging out with me while I'm editing. <laughs> it's really cute. <laughs> okay, I'll talk to you guys um, very, very soon. I love you so much. Bye.